morning or afternoon off today. So gotta do a little cardio here since I'm not getting any at work. I'm gonna finish my workout from yesterday since I couldn't finish it because we were distracted. I had Lenny, Robzilla, Andrew, Max up here. Filmed a bit. Rob filled, filmed and then Andrew also filmed. So there'll be videos on Lenny's channel and Delray Missions. Haven't done one of these in a while. I'm holding the phone because last time when I put it, when I set it down, I guess you guys heard the clicking from the fucking the treadmill. You got two feet of snow in Chicago. It's fucking 80 degrees here. It's raining. What rant? He parted me. I am kind of tired. <laughs> I slept like shit last night. I woke up fucking hallucinating a couple times. You want to see my piece and my dick? Can't do that. Any updates on Big Richard? No, I gave the updates on the podcast. Thanks, Shuey. I am well, man. Well, Jason's not on social media. I spoke to Jason today. Asked him when he was going to pick up that coin from Andrews because the guy who sent it said, accused me of stealing it when it's sitting in Andrew's house. And Jason's like, oh, what is it? I said, I told you what it was. You got to look at it. He's the expert. So Everybody wants to live in Florida now. We got a good governor. When is Dale gonna visit again? I don't know. You stuck in Charlotte on your way to St. Louis from Florida. Uh -huh. No, I'm not on trend. Just test. 200 megs a week. TRT. I tell you if I was doing it, I'm not doing that shit. Why waste the money? I tried it that once just to see what all the hype was about. Tore my pack in the middle of it and I was like, fuck this. There's no point. There really isn't any point. I'll just cruise on TRT the rest of my life and I'm fine with that. I like being 200 pounds. Test sipping eight. I'm sure Jason will make a comeback. Not anytime soon. He does stuff with PJ now, from time to time. I don't dislike McCuck. McCuck's a good guy. Milana Tan, no. <laughs> I'm 5'9". I've been getting gray hairs. It's not from, it's not from stress. I'm 42. Taking AI as well. I'm not fighting anybody. Why would I fight Jay? It does, it's not going to do any good, so I can go to jail, or get sued, <laughs> or be in the hospital, either, it, you know, it's just, there's no, you can't do that shit now. I know I wasn't getting up at 4.30 a.m. to drive an hour to go play patty cake with him in a fucking parking garage. No thank you. It's my day off. He knew that. He's just being a troll. You guys know that. He wouldn't have done shit anyway. If I would have showed up, he would have extended his hand. He doesn't want to fight anybody either. Yeah, I saw somebody secretly recording Jason in the gas station. It's stupid. All he was doing was buying some Oreos. Big Richard is okay. You know, he's alive, like he said, but his doctor, he... Doctor told him to get off testosterone, so that's it. He's completely natty now, and he shrunk up. He still goes to the gym four or five times a week, but he's a little, you can tell he's a little depressed about it, because Richard likes being big. He tips on sleeping better. Melatonin. Lenny's lasagna shins. 
are not good. I'm telling him they're going to get fucking amputated. He just says, I know. He doesn't care. He'd rather... He doesn't, he doesn't want to take care of his health. He'd rather be dead than be small. And he thinks if he, you know, has to get everything that's wrong with him treated, he's going to not be able to be a big freak, which he'll always be big. At this point, it's still, we, I said it in the video, I don't know if it'll make it in the final cut, but I just said, what is the point anymore? Never going to be a pro bodybuilder at this point. I mean, let's just face it, it's time to come to reality, but he doesn't, it's not the way he's wired. What do taco queens fart smell like? Oh, she doesn't fart around me. She's a, she's a lady. And I don't want to hear it either. It's disgusting. That's one of the biggest turnoffs for me anyways, hearing a woman fart. It's fucking disgusting. Lenny has great advice for everyone except himself. That's, that's partly true. When we come to California with the crew, <laughs> doesn't look like ever with the way that state's going. The fuck wants to go there? too bad it's a beautiful state just filled with a bunch of dopes no I don't talk to Jay anymore I have no interest for what he, he's he never takes responsibility for his actions he's a He's always got an excuse or blame somebody else. It's just, and if you say something, he'll just totally change the subject when you're trying to talk some sense into him. Oh, uh, fuck him. Like the, like the old saying, misery loves company. And that is so true in his case. Fucking guy's pause due to poor connection, sorry. Oh, my cock didn't die. As far as I know. Lenny said he did a live the other day. I texted with Adam the other day. Fine. Yesterday's activities were good, except when he was back. You know, the other day he's like, yeah, I'll come up around two. Then yesterday morning he called me, said I'll be about three. Okay, Andrew gets here about, you know, because Andrew's always on time, 2.15. Lenny didn't show up till almost five, 4.30. So by then we were, we we're kind of, we we're a little irritated. So of course, I'll come off as always the asshole in the video, but that's because you don't know what happens beforehand. So I was kind of annoyed and then my workout sucked. So, but that's all right, I'll make up for it today. I'll save this life, sure. Jason, no, Jason doesn't want to be on camera. Unless he's getting paid by PJ. Andrew will probably uh, post a video tonight or tomorrow. He had to work today, so he's got to do a lot of editing. Taco Queen's only fan. She didn't. She took that down. Well, it's not working. I have estrogen blocker, but I don't take it unless I feel unless I feel my nipples, which I don't. So. How much longer is Lenny going to have that car? I don't know. He's got to get it fixed. It's leaking coolant, so. If you hopped on any gear, then trend. Uh, I've done Hanovar and Deca. I might, I have like five mLs of that Deca left. I might start taking that if my elbows start hurting again. Yeah, I'm adulting today. I'm gonna train and I gotta do some pressure washing outside. Would you vote for governor if he runs through DeSantis? Absolutely. He's great, man. But sooner or later, he'll wind up getting canceled too. I'll figure that one out. Have you ever been chased or bit by a dog delivering mail? Yes. Why would I let Jason live with me? He's, he's good. He's got, he's got a place to live.
Anavar was good. Yeah, it's... It, Deck a dick. I didn't get that though. It's only five weeks, so that didn't. That was one thing I was scared of about it, but it did help my joints for sure. The ruby. That's what I was telling Lenny yesterday. What the hell is the point? You come, almost kill yourself to compete in the fucking Mickey Mouse show that you have to pay to get in. It's just, it's, there's nothing to gain. Done, been there, done that. It's like stop being like fucking Jason. Just every year, it's the same shit over and over. Good God. The doctor's not seen Lenny's legs. He's too stubborn. It's a problem. And he said he's had numbness in his feet for years. Isn't that great? What does that tell you? I'm not a doctor, but I mean, from what, from the feedback we've gotten, it's looking like a double amputee. And if that happens, what kind of quality of life is that? You're dealing with some baby mama drama and you need some advice, DM me. Depending on what, what you're dealing with, that's never fun. When will you and the taco queen make your baby taco? <laughs> You can't. I'm snipped. No more children. We have four between us, so she's one and I got three, so we're good, man. Yeah, real freaks have numbness in their feet for years and ignore it. I, he doesn't like going to the doctor because he doesn't want to hear what they have to say. He doesn't want to, he doesn't want to know. Lenny is the dumbest smart person there is. <laughs> Why are you afraid? I'm not afraid of Jay. <clears throat> Why would I be? <sighs> New t-shirt designs, message the Misfits Gear Division IG page. Palm still runs that. I don't know why he's obsessed with me. I really don't, it's weird. Worse than a Psycho X. Makes no sense. That's all he's got. That's all the material he's got. It's funny though, his drunk lives are great. It's, it's funny watching him embarrass himself. He's a complete fucking mess too. Never seen him look that bad. I can only imagine how bad he stinks. All right, Rob Zilla just texted saying he's gonna post the uh, videos today. I don't know exactly what time, but you'll see on the Big Lenny channel. If you were to lose all social media access, do you think he'd just kill himself? Well, he's slowly killing himself. Now he doesn't give a shit. If he dies tomorrow, he doesn't care. He's a miserable person. He's got a big inheritance to live for, but his mother will probably outlive him with the way he takes care of himself. He didn't support Jay when he tried to get out of a bullshit. You guys see what's on camera. I was breaking his balls, trying to tempt him, just, just fucking around. I knew he would never, he wouldn't stop drinking for good. You still working in the backyard to make it look? Yeah, dude, I got so, the work out here never ends. I do a little bit at a time. No, I did not buy a Glock 45. I didn't like doing that. I didn't like yelling. You know, yelling at Jay on the podcast. And then just, you know, there's no, there's no getting through to him. He doesn't care. He doesn't give a shit. And then at the end, he's like, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Yeah, okay. He, he wants the back and forth on social media, which to me is fucking gay. He has my number. We've gone back and forth. I, I don't respond to his shit. He hasn't messaged me in a while. There, there's no, he's never gonna change, so it doesn't matter. And neither am I, so it's fine. 
He doesn't think what he hated doing the podcast. He doesn't give a shit about that. Lenny fucking Lenny antagonized that. Lenny likes to Lenny likes to do that type of shit. But when he loses his legs, he'll save the same time at the gym. Oh, man, he's so slu- he's so sluggish. He, everything he does is in slow fucking motion. It's really fucking sad. But he he don't he doesn't listen. He's stubborn. That motherfucker. He's probably the most stubborn person I've ever met in my life. Probably had a lot of sodium last night. You'll see how I burnt the fucking steak like an idiot. <laughs> I cooked ribeyes, and there's so much fat in them. I left them out there for like five minutes, and I had to grill a medium, which I should have had it on low. But when I went out to flip them, the whole fucking thing was on fire. Don't worry. I had Andrew's camera and Rob Zilla's camera right on me. I want to slap them out of their hands. <laughs> burnt my fucking hand. That's all right. Lenny's pro- pretty much unemployable. That's the problem. You know, if he goes applies at jobs. And they type in his name. You know, the employers w- won't tell you that they, you know, Google search you, but I'm sure they all do. They type in his name. What do you think is going to pop up? And then you just don't get a call back. It sucks. It really does, but... And there's no money on this shit. I mean, he does the cameos. He does pretty well with the cameos, but he can't... He can't pay bills with that. It's, it's tough, man. Jay's apologies don't mean dick. I don't care. He can apologize because he just... He'll do the same shit over and over again. He's... A, Complete piece of shit, always has been, always will be. I, I just, I'm pissed at myself for wasting so much time with that asshole. Although we had some good times once in a while, but he's just, a, he's an evil motherfucker and he'll admit it. And I, you know. Yeah, the bridge is burned completely. Once he's, you know. Once he said that shit about my daughter, that's it. An innocent kid that can't help being born like that. That's fuck that's just so nasty. Ask Lenny what his living situation is. I'm not here to explain to you. No, I don't. Some people don't deserve forgiveness. I've said that before. I have nothing to apologize for. I, I just, I don't care. It's a, I'm a lot better off without that idiot around, to be honest. We could try to get Mark on the podcast. We have to call in. And we have, you guys know we got shitty equipment. So it's like over the phone, like when Bruno and Cassidy called in, it came out like shit. You know, these guys, Lenny, we, yeah, Andrew said, everybody, oh, fix the volume on the mics, talk into the microphone. If you listen to the beginning of the podcast, Andrew explained to them, talk into the mic. And I said, you got to keep it right on your chin. But who cares? We're not professional podcasters. We don't make any fucking money on it anyway, so who gives a shit? If we made some money, maybe we can buy some good equipment. I've only tried Kratom one. I never tried Fenobot. I guess Kratom's okay. I don't really. I'm on 1.3 acres. The last podcast, 71, we got into it, but it's not, again, it's nothing new. It's just the same old shit over and over. It's not just fucking, let's move on. Move on. It's okay.
you know how Mikey Manley's doing? No, I don't. I'll have to ask, gotta ask Andrew that. I think he's friends with him on Facebook. I just hope he can get back to me. Okay, I'll check it after I do this. Jason is an adult. He, he actually wanted me to rip on him. If anybody can tell you that was around, when we film, he'd be like, break my ball. They, they, he, he realized that that brought in traffic to his channel. He, you know, the piss troopers liked when I broke his balls. It's a back and forth. Jason never wanted to be treated differently. I break everybody's balls. Jason wanted to be on camera and do videos and act like a fucking dunce. Tell us, Bard, how much, I don't know how much everybody makes. Compression socks? I think he might have some. I mentioned that to him too, but I don't think. Yeah, Bruno and Cassidy are good guys. We uh, we hung out a little bit with Cassidy when we were in Vegas that night that we met Tony Huge downtown in Vegas. Um, he was with Nate and uh, Semi, the Cali Aesthetics, who's a real cool guy too. They're really going after that low liner hard, pussy liner. Which is good. That guy's a complete fucking douchebag. He's he's got to be top three worst fitness people on YouTube. Probably number one, but I don't know all of them, so I can't say. But he fucking stinks, and he's so fucking sensitive. Oh my god! And he lets everybody know, so then they just troll him even harder. I don't know why he wouldn't fight Bruno if he's a trained boxer. Why not? You got so much shit to say, fight somebody that people actually want to see. And then he posts videos of himself hitting a heavy bag. I mean, do you, does he watch this shit before he posts it? You know anything about boxing or seen even amateur boxers, like, dude, all that muscle, you can't throw punches properly. I mean, it, it just, he just looks like a roided up former dork. I don't know. I don't get it. His voice annoys the fuck out of me. Donkey Kong Fitness. I think it was him. I think it was Donkey Kong or Chucky Chee. Would send me DMs of the guy's story. I'm like, do not send me this guy's shit. I don't, I don't wanna I don't wanna watch it. You have YouTube for like 10 years and millions of views. Yeah, but most of the shit gets demonetized or limited monetization. We don't make dick. That's not what you think. Riff for 69, who will win? I don't know who Riff is. I don't know who that is. Do I enjoy big, I don't know who that is. Big boys content, never heard of her. <laughs> I wanna watch Vampires Diaries. <laughs> it's on Jason Blaha. He's another one that's, he's, he's just a fucking, he's one strange motherfucker. But it's amusing, I don't watch his stuff. I've, obviously I've seen some of this shit. One thing I said before, he was, he was, he's pretty much right on when he said bodybuilding is a death cult. It's all about whoever can, whoever's body can stand the most drugs. TRT isn't that much, what do you mean by being, is TRT that much work or is it easy to get used to? You feel great. I'm 42, I feel like I'm 25. And 
tomorrow night we're going to do another podcast with Leo, Lenny, and Kalora. I took the day off. I have vacation days. How long am I going to do cardio? I'm at 27 minutes. I'm going to end it in about five minutes. I'm fucking dripping. It's hot as balls in here. Our cool weather is gone. It's humid as fuck. Whatever happened to Chuck? I actually texted with Chuck last week. I loaned him to me. He's got a home gym too in his garage and he built, he made this, uh, this board with hooks in it to hang all his stuff. I messaged him about that. He's doing well. He wants to actually move up this in this area too. Tan 10, 10 shirts, pumps. It's Mardi Gras. Eight inches of snow in Ohio. Fuck that. So fucking boring. So go watch something else. Tommy. How bad is Lenny's condition? I don't know. You saw his legs the other day. That's really not good. Oh, it's going Friday. We're going to have 50 degrees. Good. How's Will? Well, I haven't seen Will in a while. I'm sure he's fine. Yeah, Tilt the Kill closed a long time ago. That place was all right. It kind of got fucking... The last, like, year it was open. I don't want the shit. Josh bloated Brolin. Thanks, pumps. <laughs> uh, at least I don't have the love handles like you, buddy. Fuck off. I said Leo is born. Oh, sorry. Well, then watch something else. I don't think Leo's is born. Sometimes you feel like you're in fucking science class and a lot of the shit you know when you're breaking down chemicals and talking about what this does to that it's it's a little too much for me just fucking tell me what's good and what's bad and that's that I don't need another chemical breakdown of every fucking thing Leo's a sharp dude though and I like he's he, he's a nice guy I enjoy talking to him. He's got a lot of information. Lenny does need to ditch the gear, but he's got to get bigger. The ruby. He's got a dwarf tail. Claim the fame. Congratulations. Oh, you started the hurry. Right. Goodbye, Robbie. <laughs> I spoke to Jason this morning. He called me. Loosen up how? When am I gonna own and operate a rub and tug? <laughs> uh, who is my favorite wrestler of all time? Oh. Fuck, I don't know. I liked it back in the 80s. I like the Ultimate Warrior a lot. What is a Ruby, if you don't mind me asking? Ruby's usually in September. Yeah, there's, there'll be a Presence Day video on Lenny's channel and the Misfits channel. Andrew and Rob Zilla both film. I know, Pomps, you're getting motion sickness, but if I put it down, you're gonna hear the fucking... The thing will be clicking. Jason 5'5, five, five. I think Jason's 5'6 maybe. I just stop this. Tell Robzilla to get on IG. Yeah, I don't think he has an IG anymore. He could use the, the real big Lenny Show IG if he wanted to. I think the real big Lenny Show, I think McCuck controls that one. If I'm not mistaken. Taco Queen is inside cleaning, doing laundry like she should be. I told her last night she should have been the one to cook the steaks, or I wouldn't have fucking burned them, but, you know. That's what you gotta do. Fuck it up, and then you won't have to do it again. Jason will be coming back to YouTube. Who knows? 
We don't get snow down here. Did I toss your salad on Valentine's Day? I think I might have. I might have eaten her ass. We actually fucked out here. It was great. Go to a doctor. How do you get on TRT? Yeah, I have off today. Were they still edible? What's that? Oh yeah, the steaks, yeah, they were. They just got burnt on the outside and then they're fucking raw in the middle so I just threw it in the oven for a little bit. Everybody ate though. That Stairmaster brand is a difference. It's called Sunny Health and Fitness. Sunny. S-U-N-N-Y. Oh, I already talked about Big Richard earlier. Go back and watch this. Well, if you if you get TRT through insurance, it's about ten dollars a month, and it's the best shit. What's wrong with Lenny's legs? He's a fucking diabetic, and they're gonna get fucking amputated. Paper thin skin. Why in California are they only delivering mail? Like I didn't hear that. Saul's still alive. Andrew spoke to his, uh, well, he messaged his, his daughter on Facebook. And she sent him that picture of Saul next to Bernie Sanders sitting in the chairs a few weeks ago. If you saw that on the Misfits Instagram. His granddaughter's doing good with her music career. He's still alive and kicking. Well, he's probably not kicking, but he's alive. How old were you when you were able to grow a beard? Uh, late, like 20. We're all worried for Lenny, but he doesn't, he, he's too stubborn to do anything about it. Stumpy, yeah, they'll call him Stumpy. Stumpy persons. I heard Biden does want to put travel restri restrictions on Florida. Don't let anybody fly out of here. Like Ron DeSantis, I guess, pissed him off the other day when he told him to go fuck himself, so. I don't care, I'm not going anywhere. Oh, where, do, where am I gonna go? We're wide open down here, it's great. The only thing is most, you know, public places you gotta wear a mask, mostly, but usually when you go out, if you go to the gym, you just gotta wear it when you walk in, which is fucking stupid, because as soon as you get in there, you can take it off, so what the hell's the point? Can you get a birthday shout out from Scotland? Lee Ryan Brown. Happy birthday. Will they give you TRT? If, it depends what your TR, what your testosterone levels are. If you're low, sure. If you're not, then no. His <laughs> soul's a vampire. He sleeps upside down in the closet. It's Saul. S-O-L. His name is Solomon. Not Sal. Soul. It's the last time I, I never kissed Lenny. How much day pass at Bradford Manor? I don't know. 15 buck. You do need to ditch Chicago and come to Florida. But, you know, everybody bitches about the summer heat. But from November to May, it's great down here, man. Summer is... The video is sharp as fuck. What the fuck? I'm connected to Wi-Fi, hopefully. Oh, and if you guys got cameos from Lenny, his phone is fucked up. We talked about that yesterday, too, because, you know, he's got a cheap-ass phone that doesn't have enough uh, memory. So since he likes to do research, his phone is not letting him upload the cameos. So he did all of his cameos from my phone yesterday. So if you've ordered one since yesterday, you might have to wait a little bit till he gets his phone fixed. No, I don't have braces. I did. We're not pissed about it. It's just a fucking joke. It's just, you know. Pissed about wearing masks. It's not, it actually the mask thing really isn't that fucking big of a deal. 
especially because whenever we go somewhere, you go to a restaurant or a bar, all you got to do is wear it when you walk in or when you get up and go to the bathroom. But some places really don't even, most places don't even give a shit. They don't enforce it. And garlic knots. Garlic knots didn't like swimming in the piss. Would you ever let a maniac train with you and the lads in your home gym? Sure. We did. Big Swole. He was a maniac. He came down. Lenny lives in a room. Strong, Lenny's not going to do any strongman competition. He shouldn't even be doing a bodybuilding competition. My face looks puffy. Oh well. No, I didn't grow up in Delray. I'm tired, man. I slept like shit last night. I didn't drink either. Who was the bearded guy in your gym dressed in black and left? That's Max, Russian Max. You guys, some of you guys know he's the one. He used to trigger Jason really bad. <laughs> Jason and him went at it. But Max, didn't, he's not interested in being on camera. He's a good guy. Russian Max. Blaha said you were weak. God, I don't care what Blaha says. I doubt he did. He doesn't. I'd rather be weak and look like me and be strong and look like him. Why are you so puffy? Maybe because I'm holding my head down. Who knows? It's not a great angle, but I'm not a fucking... I'm not that vain. I don't really give a shit. Is Lenny getting, they're not scabs. They're just open fucking wounds. They haven't even scabbed up. It's just leaking pus and blood. It's awful. Do you miss winding Jason up in the gym? Yeah, actually, now looking back, it was kind of fun. Some of the shit, we, we had a good time. It got, it gets, it was annoying when it was like every day constantly, but when we spread it out to once, twice a week, that was fine. Do I do a lot of dumbbell presses? Eh, I wouldn't say a lot, so I mix it up. No, the Taco Queen isn't a jealous person. Camera adds weight, Ross. Yeah, who gives a fuck? Who cares? Puffiness from too much test. No, actually, I haven't. I was supposed to take my shot. What the hell is today? Say, oh yeah, I take my shot tonight. You wanna see around the gym? See, that's why I need something to hold all this shit. It's a, it's a little bit of a mess from yesterday. Get that on. Get that. Lenny forgot to, Lenny couldn't bring his uh, Winston Churchill. You know this, because he had to walk to the front of the neighborhood to meet Rob Zell and he couldn't carry the picture that far. And then, get all this. This thing. You guys saw this last time I did it. Oh. That's it. Oh, I got a kegerator too. Got to hook this up though. Double tap. That'll be fun. Next party we'll hook that up. Jason still works at Publix. I think he's still do doing Instacart too. Why would the post office be in trouble? That we, there's a Democrat in office who should be just perfect. I tell, Rob Zilla is fucking, he's tall. He's as, at least as tall as Lenny. He might even be a half inch or an inch taller than Lenny. He's like 6'4". Am I gonna keep Lenny's ashes in my gym? <laughs> I don't know what Lenny wants us to do with his ashes. You're gonna end up 
knocking the, that wall down when you get more equipment. Uh, no, I'll probably, I just have to rearrange some shit over there. It was tight in here last night with all of us in here, to be honest with you. That's, I couldn't get a good workout in. Yeah, who cares? I don't care. Can you get a younger woman? How much younger do you want? No, all this stuff was sent to me. I, some very generous maniacs. And I appreciate all of it. It's great. Why do you keep your weight the same and not bulk up? It's recomponing. Turned some mush into muscle once I got on the TRT, which is good. I don't I don't want to be any bigger. You think I want to walk around like a fucking like an asshole? Walk like you got a fucking cucumber rammed up your ass. Popping out of your clothes like a freak. I, I don't I think it's a stupid look. Who will live longer, Big J? That's a good one. We should start a Deadpool. We should get a Deadpool going. Taco Queen and the kids are great. I inject twice a week. I do a half cc on Tuesday, a half cc on Friday. 200 megs. Inject into my thighs, which <laughs> I did it one night after I did legs. That didn't feel too fucking good because my quad was pretty pumped up and I just, it, the fucker hurt. No, I'll never forgive that guy. Move on. Time to move on. What is recomp? You turn the mush into muscles. Lenny will outlive you all. You, you might be right. Yeah, he's gonna wind up getting gangrene. You could see you you guys have noticed that his calves, his ankles and shit, the discoloration over the last couple of years. Best place to live in Florida, not Miami. Too many East Coast cookie cutters. Where I'm at is the fucking best. I love it up here. Advice for teenager, Brad? <laughs> There's... Wrap it up. Don't cream pie anybody. Did Andrew film for the YouTube channel? Yes, he did. What made you never do any type of performing enhancer before TRT? Well, actually, I did testosterone when I was, I moved to Vegas and I stopped skateboarding after about six months and got into weightlifting. And after about, what the, I can't remember, I was 19? I had to have been 19. I did a cycle of test and winstrol. Injectable, I got, my buddy used to go down to Mexico and get everything. That's when you can get like a $10 day uh, passport pass. You drive down there, you, you could go to any pharmacy and get whatever you wanted. I did a test and Winstrol. And the Winstrol, the injectable Winstrol was like, a, it wasn't oil based, it was like milky. That shit fucking hurt. It was sore, I, I shot my ass, and it was, you keep, I couldn't even sit down for days. And then after, I, I gained about 20 pounds of muscle. I got pretty strong, but then after that, I was like, I don't, you know, I don't need this shit. So then I didn't do shit till I got on TRT in, uh, when I was 36, six years ago. So it was like 17 years before I ever did it again. But that injectable, the Winstrol, no, no bueno. I think because it crystallizes or something, it's hard. And I, you know, you got to massage it in once you shoot it, but it, it shit stinks and it dries you out. It's just not. 
you have to do if you're working out, you want to hit your plateau first and however long that takes you, six months, nine months to where you just are not getting any stronger. And that's when you, that's when you take a PED to get you over that plateau. And then actually I spoke to JT a couple months ago. He's doing well. He's starting to uh, reinvent clinic. I think it's, you know, a TRT clinic, all that shit. Liquid IV stuff. He just opened one in Boca. Well, they just got a place. And his uh, he's got two steel knuckle custom shops. He's real busy doing a lot of motorcycles. He's got a boat. He's, JT's doing well. Yeah, somebody who's an expert took Winstrol and then decides to squat 600. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't smoke cigarettes anymore. Will JT come on the podcast? Oh, we could, he probably would if I asked him. I grew up down here in West Boca. West Boca Raton. Uh, I haven't spoken to Synthol Mark. I know he lives in Orlando. What happened to my head? I don't know what happened to my head. What happened to your head? Winnie is good for blowing out your knees. <laughs> no, I didn't vote for Biden. I didn't vote. I didn't even vote this year. What's the point of voting? You saw what happened. There's no point in even fucking voting. They put in who they want. It's a fuck. The whole it's the system's fucked. We've known that for years. I bought some items online, but I'm missing stuff. Message, if you're talking about the Misfit Skier message pumps. I'd say Florida is the place to be. Uh, it's my Florida or Texas from what I hear. Voting is a fucking joke. Who was that blonde chick that was with Deep Ball Debbie? I don't know. I think that might have been Tim. I think you're talking about Tim Anderson's wife or ex-wife, Laura. She's a nice lady. She had a fucking, she had a pretty smoking body for her age. She was 50. Never do HGH, Brad. Your head will double in size. Why would I do that? I have no reason to do that anyway. Yeah, I saw that. They recalled the shithead governor. Now all of a sudden they want to count every signature, but it didn't matter for the... Everybody, if you... Listen... It's fucked. The system is fucked. Politicians are corrupt, man. Never. These motherfuckers. <laughs> like I've always said, follow the money. That's all you got to do. You want to know where the corruption is? Just follow the fucking money. Military industrial complex runs this fucking show. We're going to end up in a war while he's in, in office too. You watch. Yeah, she's doing good. She did have COVID. She's fine. It lasts her a little over a week. She lost taste and smell. I never got it. Nobody else got it, so the kids are good. She's good. If you don't need an ID to vote, but you need an ID to get a beer, really. I know. You're right, man. It's so fucked up. Again, what do you do? The media also runs runs everything. The media is so is so full of shit. All these news stations are fucking complete fucking joke. The bullshit that they feed people. And then you can really this is this is the last year is when every idiot showed their true colors or when you could figure out who the people that are close to you who are the fucking dumb ones by the by the way they act. I know. Believing every single fucking thing. I follow Emma on Instagram. I'm not in contact with her. I think she's uh, she's in Michigan. I think she moved out to Detroit. I mean, I get. I understand why because her family's there. But oof, fuck that place. I mean, if you can take the cold, if some, you like the cold, which I don't know why anybody would. It's snow like that. It's nuts. He 
He was running for office and he said he wanted his piece of the pie. Yeah, there you go. Thoughts on Bitcoin? What is it at? Is it up to 50,000 yet? Shit. I don't know. Not applying for USPS in Michigan. Could I transfer to Florida? Yeah, absolutely. We have people transferring. If good vitamin D levels, COVID won't affect you. Make me think of Lenny. Yeah, well, get out in the sun. But no, they tell you, stay in your house. Don't go near anybody. When the flu is worse than that, but whatever. I said that from the fucking beginning. Not say COVID's a real thing. It's just not. It's, it's not. They act like. They were acting like if you get it, you're dead. They just. They saw an opportunity, they capitalized on it, and they got exactly what the fuck they wanted. It's all playing out. And you could say conspiracy theory all you want. That it, a lot of that conspiracy theory shit is true, whether you want to believe it or not. Could you call Luke Jones a cookie cutter, please? Luke Jones, you're a cookie cutter. First discovered under a Delray Mew Beach in disgusting <laughs> uh, I'm not I don't talk about the stock market or what I invest in because you can't. There's because if I'm wrong with certain shit and you invest money, then you wanna get pissed at me. So do your own research. It's all there right in front of you. When you go if T D Ameritrade, when you go on there, you can look at every stock and the chart of you know, there's do your own research, make your own decision. It's gambling, you know. All right, all right, I'm done, guys. I'll I'll post this.